Lovers of Star with Sparkle Designs by Star. I just want to come on here and share with you a quick tutorial. Um, I will be using the Design Ambassador Kit from Jesse James Beads. This is for the month of October. And the beads that I'm going to be using is, um, I'm going to be using some of the uh, Mini Mix in Blackberry Baby. And I'm also, this is what they look like. I'll be using some of these and I'm also going to be using the bead strand in amethyst eclipse and we're going to be making a bracelet so um the beads that I have okay the beads that I have picked out are three of these beads these agate beads from the um amethyst eclipse from Jesse James Beads and I've picked these amethyst beads quartz or amethyst beads out of that same mix and then I picked this out of the blackberry baby mix these little black ones um, I also have these little sheriff stars spacer beads from the um, bead strand and amethyst eclipse that we're going to be using so we have those. This is going to be my focal in the middle. And I got this from Hobby Lobby. And I'm going to make a bracelet out of it. I also have um, some of these purple crystal beads from my own stash. I have two crimp beads in gun metal. And then I also have some black um, soft flicks. This is Econoflex Soft Flex Stainless Steel Nylon Coated um, 20 pound test strength. Um, I got this from Hobby Lobby when it was on clearance. So that's what we're going to be using to string our beads. And hopefully we have enough beads. <clears throat> if not, we'll have to add a few more. But we're going to lay our beads out. Um, this is going to be our focal, like I said. Um, and then I want these right here, and then we are going to, here, let me put it where y'all can see. Here is our focal, and we're going to do these beads, we're going to do our little sheriff's stars, we're going to do a crystal, we're going to do, um, let's see, these two right here and then we're gonna do these and then I better put that up there um we're gonna do our little sheriff stars again our crystal beads these two more of these and our black beads let's zoom out a little okay that's what we have so far. Um, let me find my tape measure. Okay, I found my um, tape measure. Okay, this is about eight inches. We'll you'll see. We may need to um, do a little less, depending. I hope y'all can see this okay. It seems like it's a little bit yellow. I don't know. Okay. So, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take, we're going to move this up here out of the way. First thing we're going to do is we're going to take our wire and we're going to put on our crimp bead, just like this, and we're going to take one of our lobster clasp right here and attach. Okay, so this is what we have right here and we're just going to take it and we're going to fold it up like this and I forgot to mention what tools you're going to need. You're going to need your flush cutters. You are also going to need some crimping pliers and that should be all that you need but we're just gonna pull it down make sure your wires are not crossed and i'm gonna have 
have to use my pliers here. Okay, and I'm just gonna flat crimp because this is going to be my bracelet, so it doesn't have to be perfect, and I'm just gonna squish it down really good, just like that. <clears throat> okay, now we're going to string our beads. So we're gonna start with this side. I'll add this pretty blackish purple agate bead. Our little star spacer. Our crystal bead. Black bead. This amethyst bead. And I'm making this bracelet this way because I have made one before similar to this. And I just like the way that it looks. So that's what we're going to do. And then we're going to add another crystal bead. Another crystal bead. Another one of these. And this one. And we're going to put this on here. Like this. Push it, pull it down like that. Okay. So this is what we have so far. Okay. I think we need to add something in the back to break up the, um, oops, let's try one of these rondelles and see how that looks, because now we're going to beat up the other side. While we're doing beating up the other side, and see what we have. We may have to take some off. And if we do, that's okay too. Okay. So this is what we have going on. Let's see how long this is. <clears throat> okay, about seven inches right there. We're gonna go ahead and hook this on and see what we got for real, for real, for real. Stick this in here. And you have to finagle it sometimes. That's okay too. I have a feeling we're gonna have to do that. Let's see how long it is right there, like that. Um, tape measure fell on the floor. So, oh yeah. We're going to try it real quick and see what it looks like before we crimp it. So, we just put our little crimp bead on like this. And then we're gonna go in here. Hang on just a second. Okay, I think that's gonna be perfect. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to go back through this crimp bead right here. And I'm gonna go through a few beads. I'm gonna go back through, I need to clip it up. Go back through here, through a few of our beads to get some leverage. I'll do it off camera real quick. Okay, I'm gonna pull it through here and we're gonna pull it down. And because we wanna pull up the slack
make sure you want to make sure there's not too much slack i mean you want some because you want it to give but you just don't want too much because if you have too much slack it's not going to uh, work properly okay let's make sure we got enough slack going on I want it to be a little loosey-goosey but you don't want to have too too much give between these beads okay so i'm gonna hold it like this pull it down just a little bit and like i said we're gonna flat crimp and you don't you want to make sure that your two wires are not crossed and mine are not because i pulled them and then clip like this and here you go here is our bracelet that we have Ooh, I lost some beads. Okay. There you go. There's your bracelet. Looks just like that. We're going to set it on our little triangle. And this is our Jesse James beads. And the black ones are the bead mix in blue. I mean, Blackberry Baby. And the purple ones these purple ones and the little stars are in amethyst eclipse and here is our bracelet this is what it looks like nice and pretty and i like mine loose so that's how it looks and then you can use this as stacking bracelets um different things so i hope y'all enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment and I will leave a link down below to these beads. And I'll also leave a link down to the Jesse James Beads Ambassador Program. And if you have 100 subscribers or more on social media, they will be glad to work with you. You just have to send them an email. And like I said, I will leave a link to everything down below. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Um... Please tell me what you think, and I hope y'all have a blessed, fabulous day. I will see y'all next time. Bye.